Arguably, when it comes to hunting, a pair of good quality binoculars are just as important as your rifle scope. Just try glassing an entire area for several hours at a time before your shoulder gets stiff and your rifle feels like a concrete block. So, in today's video, I'll be reviewing the top 8 best binoculars for hunting. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I tried to rank them based on their quality, durability, customer reviews, and more. If you want to know about the best pricing and more information, you can check the description links below. Number 8 in my list is Mioptum Meostar B115 X56 HD Binoculars. You can get A-class quality from Miopto without having to pay A-class prices. Gray's Sporting Journal recognizes the value and quality in this Miostar, and if you know what's good for you, you will too. The Miostar B115 X56 BD is large and heavy, but no larger or heavier than the following Swarovski binocular. And like its competitor, it also features world-renowned glass with HD quality and ED elements. Seeing further and longer is the Miostar's expertise. Extreme long-range hunters are going to appreciate the pure usability of this exceptional binocular that's more price-attractive than any of its challengers in its class. For full size and full performance, it's got our full recommendation. Number 7 in my list is Leupold BX1 McKenzie Binocular. The McKenzie line has entry-level and low price tags at its core, but it may prove to be exactly what you want. Better yet, Loop holds the name behind this unit. The eye relief on these hunting binoculars may test you with its short 13.7mm, not exactly friendly for those who wear shades or specs. But the optical quality should be better than most since it not only has FMC coatings, it also boasts phase-coated prisms, which helps to correct for roof prism deficits. The result is better picture quality across the board. It's ready for the weather that you'll inevitably see first day of the hunt, and it's tripod ready, so you'll be able to mount this puppy to steady the 10x power. Only weighing 22 ounces, it's right within lightweight specs, and it has a 305 feet by 1000 yards field of view. Good enough. The McKenzie BX1 is a simple pair of binoculars, but the phase coatings are needed on even the most basic roof prism binoculars. With this feature, your roof prism binoculars are ready to go whenever you are. Number 6 in my list is Bushnell Engage 12 X50 Binoculars. The Engage is one of the newest series released by Bushnell, and as a high-powered binocular, it has low light conditions and long-distance obstacles conquered. The eye relief is 15 mm, which is still a little on the short side for many, but there has been more than a gripe or two about it being shorter than that. You may want to rethink this spec if you wear glasses while glassing. This model has every optical feature you could look for just short of image stabilization. It has ED glass for reducing color fringing, phase correction coatings for improved contrast and resolution, and dielectric coatings for even more light transmission. The EXO barrier coating is Bushnell's latest exterior coating that protects the objective lens from debris, water, oil, you name it. For such a high-powered pair of binoculars with huge objective lens, it's quite lightweight at just under 30 ounces. It also has a decent field of view of 280 feet by 1,000 yards. The locking diopter is a high-end feature that you may appreciate. It's not the most expensive binocular in this lineup, and yet it's one of the most decked-out units of the lot. Number 5 in my list is Aflan Midas 8X42 Hunting Binoculars. It's another birding binocular, but we found its features more than adequate for hunting. In fact, you can always count on Midas to give you more than what you'd expect. The 8X42 model is popular with birders, no doubt, but there are many hunters that can't quite keep a 10X magnification binocular steady enough for their needs, and you have hunters that are often in tree stands and thick brush that find 8X more than adequate. You can check out the 10X42 model that is cheaper in price and has the same features, but it's not quite as popular as the 8X magnification. As the 8X magnification model, it has a much larger field of view. It has 85 feet more than the 10X magnification model, maxing out at 426 feet by 1,000 yards. The fully coated lenses are HD quality because it has ED glass, dielectric coating, and phase correction coatings, 
it has the works. This means little to no chromatic aberration, sharp resolution, ultimate clarity, and picture-worthy image quality. You can get you'll get some decent low-light coverage with this little unit. Quality extends to the build with its magnesium chassis and argon gas. Both are better than an aluminum chassis and nitrogen gas. Just so you know. But there has been some speak about the focus wheel. Few have mentioned its stiffness and a squelching sound during use. Perhaps this mechanism was over-greased? It doesn't pose an issue for most, but still something to take note of. Everything about the Midas will help to bring you closer to bagging your gold trophy. After all, it does have the Midas touch of quality to it. Number 4 in my list is Vortex Optics Crossfire 10X50 Binoculars. Who said you can't get optics with HE for under 200 bucks? The Vortex Optics Crossfire HD proves those skeptics wrong. This Crossfire HD model has extra-large objective lens with their 50mm diameter. While you can expect exceptional low-light usage out of them, you're also tacking on extra poundage raising the weight to 30.4 ounces. Yep, it's a little bit heavy. But with HE optics, you might find that extra weight worth it. What you get is better resolution and clarity, both of which you'll need to be out at dusk and dawn. The wide field of view of 320 feet by 1,000 yards is excellent for a 10x50. Of course, since this is a Vortex, you're not only getting their exceptional VIP lifetime warranty in the buy, but your binocular comes fully weatherproof and shockproof. All the types of protection you need for a Bino. Glass pack accessories included are the binocular case and harness. Stock accessories include the comfort neck strap, rain guard covers, and tethered objective lens caps. For the extra light transmission and HE optics, with all the foundational features and trappings included, Vortex Optics gets our vote. Number 3 in my list is Vortex Optics Diamond Back 10X42 Binoculars. The Vortex Optics Diamond Back 10X42 is a longtime favorite series of optics from this awesome brand, but the newest line release is the best version yet. The Diamond Back is 10x10 for value. It has incredible features for the price, and of course, it comes with Vortex's VIP warranty that has won over many a buyer. As usual, the brand throws in some accessories, but this binocular comes with the glass pack case and glass pack case harness. Also included are some stock cap covers and a neck strap that some like and some don't. As for the binocular itself, it's an excellent optic with multiple coatings that includes FNC, dielectric, and armor tech coatings. You'll have clear, sharp, and bright images all day and night long. Low light and even dark coverage will be no obstacle for this pair. Color fidelity is kept intact and is appreciated since the additional HE optics and coatings significantly reduce chromatic aberration. It's very lightweight at 21 ounces, is fully fog and waterproof, and you can expect shockproof protection with its rubber armored body. With multi twist up eye cups, you can find decent eye relief up to 15 millimeters. You also have a good field of view of 330 feet by 1,000 yards for a 10x42. All in all, this model of the latest Diamondback line has outdone itself. It's one of the best binoculars for the money you will ever find. Number 2 in my list is Vortex Optics Razer HD 12X50 Hunting Binocular. Surprised to see a Vortex Optics binocular top the lineup when we've got world-known brands here too. That's because Vortex always does it well. The optical quality, design and aesthetics, and of course, price of this Vortex Optics Razer HD 12X50 has all been packaged together to present a binocular more practical and affordable for the everyday binocular user. Granted, a thousand bucks is not affordable, but compared to its competition, it's a steal. It was a toss-up between the Vortex Optics Viper HD and this Razer, but in the end, we went with Vortex's most prized high-end series. Its dimensions are more in line with what a hunter could use in a practical manner in the field for a full-size binocular. Vortex didn't leave anything behind on this razor. It's been preened and primped with a lightweight magnesium chassis, APO glass, and the true open hinge design. If there's a brand that caters to all the needs of a hunter and wildlife watcher, it's Vortex. 
Number one in my list is Maven B 1.210 X42 binocular. What do the Maven B 1.2 binoculars have over any other hunting binocular in the lineup? Proven optical performance in the field. The 10X42 specs lends itself to all sorts of hunting environments, be it in a tree stand or out in the open plains. The optical quality is what separates the B1.2 pair from the stiff competition of hunting binoculars. It features wide-angle schmidt peckin prisms with dielectric coatings and ED glass in the objective lenses. Superb brightness is hard to achieve at low light, but not with the B1.2s. If I can spot and track a gang of elk at 1400 yards at last legal light, and I did, you can too. I found the tripod cap to be small and difficult to remove, but mounting them is not necessary with 10x magnification. They're compact and lightweight to be used freehand and comfortably worn with the included neoprene neck strap. Field testing with the B1.2 binoculars was an awesome experience. The sharpness, contrast, and color fidelity left a deep impression, and the optical performance proved to be valuable when looking for the smallest of details in the hunting field. During the hunt, that small detail of a flickering ear or the tip of a moving rack is what you'll need to fill your tag. Alright guys, this was our today's video. If you find this video helpful for you, then like the video and if you come to our channel first time, then hit the subscribe button for our amazing upcoming videos. Be sure to check out the links in the description for the updated price of all products discussed in this video. Hope you have a great day and see you soon in the next video.